I told you all when I get that $50 account up <clears throat> to $200, I will make a withdraw. And then now i am got the $50 account to $200. I'm going to try to leave a $100 balance in here and get that up to $300. And I'll just take some out and keep trading on small accounts to prove and to show you guys that we can still make money with a little bit of money. You don't have to have a whole lot of money. Of course, if we have more money, we can make more money, but we can also make money with $50. So I am going to head on over to Hugo's way and in Hugo's way, I will go to internal transfer here. This is from MT4 to wallet. So I would go to MetaTrader to wallet here. Select from account, this account here that had the 200 in it. And select to wallet, USD wallet. Amount to transfer. I'm going to say 105 because I believe that there are going to be some fees, not too sure. So there you can see 105 at the top on the right into my wallet now where it was $0. So from there, I just need to withdraw this amount. select the wallet which will be bitcoin my bitcoin wallet All right select the withdrawal type bitcoin amount to withdraw would be the 105 and i would go to wherever i buy my bitcoin before i put it on my mt4 account which i use cash app once I request withdrawal, I have to put in my cash app address. So, guys, thanks so much for watching. And I just wanted to show you guys because I don't want to share my Bitcoin address. So, I just wanted to show you how to get this far. Thanks so much for watching and continue to watch me grow my small account. So, the next step is growing my $100 balance that's left over to $300. Happy trading. Oh, so you guys. So under the wallet now, you see like that time clock that says $105. So it takes some time with Hugo's way. I'm not sure about any other brokers except for LQDFX. It takes some time as well, but it, it happened very quickly for me within about 20 minutes i'm not sure how long it will take with hugo's way but you do see that it is here the usd at the very top down here where you see wallet pending withdrawals 105 dollars there and also when i did the withdrawal earlier i also told you guys to click here at Bitcoin. I'm sorry about that. You would put USD here. You would put US dollar if you are in the US, you know, the Euro, depending on where you're located. So I would put the US dollars here for my withdrawal as so and then Bitcoin and then the amount you want to withdraw. And from there, you would go to whatever you use again i said i use cash app so i will go to bitcoin deposit bitcoin and that's how you would get your address there that you need to copy over but <clears throat> i didn't want to do it on camera just in case there are some scammers or crazy um, people trying to get your Bitcoin address. I'm not sure so much what they can do with it, but deposit funds. But I was also told that they can use that with, to withdraw funds as well. So 
Um, that's why I didn't show that part, but copy the address the same way you do when you make a deposit. And then you go back over to Hugo's way. And after you hit request withdrawal, it'll ask for that address. You paste it in there. And then once your time is up, that withdrawal amount will be back onto your cash app or whatever you use to make your deposits. It will work the same way. Now I can repeat, happy trading, guys. Have a successful week. Be sure to be in my Telegram chat watching me keep it blue with gold. Sometimes it might be a red here and there, but majority, we want to keep it blue. So thanks so much for watching, guys. Happy trading.